Hello everybody, welcome back to RHD Outdoors. Today we are in Waveland. We are in the uh, the shallow side of the rocks. Some of you are familiar with these rocks uh, out here. They, they hold a lot of redfish uh, on the other side, but on this side it's a lot shallower. It's like two or three feet deep on this side. The other side is about five, six feet deep. So on this side is a good place for uh, flounder to hang out because uh, the water's calm, it's shallow and you've got a really good weed line right here. Right now it's pretty much high tide, uh, so these flounder are gonna be holding uh, right up next to this weed, uh, weed bank. Today I'm gonna be throwing a matrix shad and limbo slice, and uh, we're gonna try to put some flounder in the cooler. I hope you guys enjoy the video, and if you guys do enjoy the content, go ahead and drop me a like. <clears throat> When you drop a like on a video, it tells YouTube that it's a good video and YouTube will suggest it to more people. And the more people it suggests it to, the bigger my uh, my viewer base gets and the more uh, subscriptions I, I may get. So that really helps me out if you like the video, share the video, and then subscribe. And I hope you guys enjoy the video, so let's get fishing. Oh man. Y'all, if that is a flatty, holy cow. Oh my goodness. Big old flatty on the limbo. Ain't getting away now. I don't know if my lure will get away. He gulped it down pretty good. All right, let me see here. Without breaking anything. You got my limbo down pretty far. I'm gonna have to strip his gears. But luckily, he is a beast. Oh, now he's bleeding on me. Serves me right. It's fine because he is coming home. So it's a big old flatty, guys. Yeah, guys, picked another flatty flat up. I'm pretty good in here. This guy, I can tell by his little frog eyeballs, he's not going to be big enough. So, oh, come on now. <laughs> little, them little bitty frog eyeballs. Back you go, brother. Get bigger. Oh my goodness, y'all. Dude, that one, this one here, he feels like he is pretty hefty. And he was right up in that grass, y'all. Right up in that grass. Yeah, he's he's doing some head shakes down there. This is definitely a flat. Oh, he wolfed it. He got it wolfed. You have to do a surgery on this guy. I can find my, there they are. Let 
you guys are not playing today you guys are grabbing and swallowing That's three nice flats, guys. Three nice flats. Mm. Got him. Head shake is definitely a flounder. Another little frog. Come on, froggy. I need the toads. Send the toads my way. Oh my goodness, <laughs> did y'all see that? <laughs> that flounder came out the water, y'all. Man, they got some good ones in here. This one here got some pull, pull. Oh, that is a doormat right there. That is a doormat right there, y'all. That is a doormat. Holy cow. You can't complain about that, guys. There is no way you can complain about that. You'd be crazy, too. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That is a, an amazing fish. Mm. Absolutely amazing fish. We're gonna see this guy measures. Ow. He just bit me good. Uh, we're looking at about 18, y'all. <clears throat> Look at that big boy. It is a nice flounder, y'all. Nice flounder. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> All right, y'all, right off the weed line. <clears throat> Another one. Definitely a flatty. Come to Papa. Come to Daddy. Oh yeah. Oh, we were pulling in some quality fish today, guys. Got a little couple of frogs mixed in, but this is a good one here. And then we got a couple toads mixed in. Oh, don't break your jaw, brother. Mm. Whew. Well, this one came after it. This joker here said, give me that. He got it on the up bounce. <clears throat> I felt him hit it once, twice, and then he finally grabbed it the third time. 
I'm headed for the hills. They are stacked in here, y'all. Stacked. Back in there, limbo. Seems it hit the water, y'all. Seems it hit the water, it was in his mouth. Oh, submarine me. All right, let's not get too tangled up here. about the only thing I don't like about braid man he gets tangled up look at that he gulped it down so far it's coming out his gill come here brother <laughs> give me back my jig <laughs> thank you my friend let's go put him on a stick All right, he's almost 14. He's good to go. In with his buddies. Mm. Well, that's how uh, that bad boy right there, boy. Oh. I think we got some water on the lens. A little bit. Oh, we're good. Quick released himself, y'all. Man, this dude's, this dude's just slinging water. Man, he's slimy. You slimy rascal. He's a legal eagle. All right. Couldn't resist the limbo. Yo, friend. He says, you ain't no friend to me. Where did I get you? In the cheek? Yeah. Right in the cheek. This one was a little slow in coming. I think some mysterious title or weather phenomenon has been triggered and they have slowed down but as long as they're still biting a little bit I'm gonna keep fat I'm gonna keep casting for them alrighty that one took a minute but there he is y'all and it feels like a good one Right. 
Oof. Made a oh man, this seat is hot. <laughs> Whoa, now. Alrighty. Another flatty flat. Alright y'all, as much as I hate to call it quits, the bite has pretty much stopped, but not before we could put about eight or nine uh, nice flounders in the cooler, and about three of them were, <laughs> were pretty large. We had that one 18 inch, and then I think I caught another one uh, that was about the same size. So <clears throat> the wind has also picked up. We got a little bit of chop going on out here, and I noticed the, uh, the waves are crashing on the rocks a little bit more. So I got to go all the way down there to get back home. I don't want to get caught in anything rough in this little boat. <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, leave it a thumbs up, share the video, and if you like the content, please consider subscribing. Uh, it helps my channel grow. This is the type of fishing that I do. So with that, we're going to go ahead and head on out of here, and until next time, we'll see you on the water.